Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today, I got another classic monster game play for you guys. 68 and 6 with the M13 best class setup. Stay towards the end of the video so I can show you guys what attachments I was running on that weapon. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you are new to the channel. Turn the post notifications on so y'all can get my future video. At the end of the video, please drop a like. Dropping a like on this video will allow me to make more videos just like this one. Without further ado, let's get into the video and I'll see you guys in a second. Let's get. That one. Got him, got him. Let's go. Bro, we're doing it, bro. <laughs> we're doing it, yeah. Got him. Yo, I see somebody in the window. Somebody in the window. Got him. Yeah, window, window, window. Got him, got him. Got him. Let's go. Let's go. Got him. Let's go. Bruh. I'm, bro, I'm deadly right now, man. Yo, we about to do it, man. Everybody's on D and E, yo. I know if I got a lot of people, though. Let's get it. Let's get it. What the? Bro, was that five kills? Yo, <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Yo. Let's go, yo. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get him, man. Yo, that was like four to five kills with a missile. And then I got like four to five kills with the uh, VTO jet. Bro, where they at? I just killed a whole bunch, bro. They can't even respond. Are they gonna respond in the other side? Bro, I probably just had like 20 kills, yo. Oh my god, bro. Okay, okay, we do. Yo, that shit was crazy, bro. Let's go, let's go. Come on, come on. Let me run up here. Let me run up here. Yeah, I'm gonna make my way to uh, to see. Shit, I'm out of ammo. I'm out of ammo. Now I ain't gonna chase that guy. Forget that. It's ammo. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Somebody around here. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Got one. Let's go. Somebody up here. Damn! Let's go, let's go. Got him. Let's go. Got him. Got him out the window. Come on, come on. Yo, we're running out of time, though. I mean, we're going to win anyway, though. We're going to win anyway. Moving up, moving up. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yo, I just saw somebody over there, though. Got one? Yo, a special. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, a special. I'm gonna see, though. I'm gonna see, yo. Basic about my damn self. Ain't nobody here. Yeah, I'm gonna go around. I'm gonna go around. Oh! Okay, okay. I'm on the bottom, I'm on the bottom. Oh, nice, nice. I just flank him. Let's go. Come on, we got this, we got this. And we won this shit, we won this shit, though. And we won this shit, yo. Let's go, let's get it, yo. 68 kills, yo. 68, bro. How many times I die for real? Let me see. Let me see. 68 and 6, yo. 
uh, you guys so this is the class setup I got for the M13 this is the best class setup for the M13 they made this weapon absolutely overpowered made this weapon actually a god weapon obviously we got the monolithic suppressor we got sound suppression and damage range so this weapon is all about damage and stability at the same time it has a lot of aim down the side speed so anyway so we got them on a little suppressor these are the two key attachments i'm going to tell you guys to use this attachment so if you guys want to kill faster than m13 go ahead and use these two attachments so these are the two attachments you got to use the barrel you got to use the tempest marksman so this one gives you damage range bullet velocity and recoil control so don't use none of these two on the top they garbage y'all use this one right here tempest marksman gives you damage range bullet velocity and recoil control the other key attachment you got to use on this one is the ammunition use a 30 blackout 30 round mag this will give you more damage range no visible tracer and no enemy scores you can see the damage uh, where uh, right below accuracy will say damage and range the damage go up so you got damage here and you got damage here right on top of that this will give you damage range so this weapon becomes absolutely busy and then obviously we need a good um on the barrel so we're going to use the ranger foregrip i was going to go with the tactical foregrip because it gives you a, it gives me a little more mobility and control but as you can see my range and accuracy goes down um i'd rather sacrifice a little bit uh, control and mobility to have that extra range and that extra accuracy so i can go ahead and shoot from a distance so anyway the ranger foregrip is the best one and obviously we're going to use the m13 skeleton stack so anyway as you can see this one is good, uh, but your mobility goes down like so much, you know what I'm saying? I was going to use this one, but as you can see, like every other attachments other than this one kind of decrease a lot of stuff on the stats. So anyway, these are the five attachments you got to use to make this N13. That's what I call it, 3.0 die cast. This is a 3.0 die. This weapon is going to kill people so, uh, real fast. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time on the next video.